since you draw so many things about politicians, about political parties, have there been instances when politicians have called you back and say, Nan cartoon tumba chanag maadi diri maare. My caricature is nice. Have you gotten good feedback from the people that you've criticized in your cartoons? Uh, so far, I have not got anything from like that. <laughs> but uh, in my, in the, at the beginning of my career, I felt it in a op completely opposite way. Uh, it happened in a small uh, place like Kundapura. I had my exhibition then. Then I had some caricatures also. One of the caricatures was of Ajaruddin. He was at the peak of his uh, career. Uh, of course, you know his face. I made his cartoon, uh, caricature. Of course, the uh, caricature means it's ex exaggeration of any way. So for that, I got some abuse as their dates. So this trolling is not a new... Uh, uh, thing in our country yes. for special cartoons. But yes. that, now the trolling has become a profession now. It's a paid profession now. <laughs> so that's the only difference. We are addressing the unemployment concern in the country. <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much. I must, I must ask this question to Satish Acharya. Do you think your trolls take you more, I mean, uh, take more offense to your cartoons than the people in your cartoons? Actually, they take my cartoons more seriously <laughs> than me, actually. I enjoy drawing cartoons. I mean, I don't attach too much uh, attention or uh, value to my, my opinion. It's my personal opinion. But they attach more opinion, more value to the uh, cartoons I draw. Uh, that's strange. I mean, troll is more organized now. It's not, it's not organic. Uh, in Kannada, we call it uh, Sangatita. So it's uh, literally Sangatita. <laughs> it's uh, organized. It's not organized. Uh, it's not uh, organic. Uh, so you know where it comes from and uh, which cartoons get offended. Of course, every political party, they have their own IT cell. So every go everybody trolls me. Uh, some trolls uh, me in a different way and uh, some are more uh, toxic. Uh, that's it. Every, every political party, uh, even uh, cricketers, cricketers, film stars, they have their own army, army of trolls. Uh, so it's uh, difficult to draw anything uh, without offending anyone. Well, all the equal opportunity offenders cannot afford not to offend anybody. Sandeep, that brings me to you. Satish pointed out that uh, probably uh, people who criticize him for his cartoons add more value to his opinions than he would like to himself. So is that a conundrum? Do you want people to take your cartoons seriously or do you want them to don't take this so seriously? It's just a cartoon at the end of the day. No, it's just not a cartoon. You know, it's not just, I, do, I, would, I would not want to say, you know, I would not uh, want to be modest to that extent. It's a cartoon. It's a, it has a certain purpose, right? And, you know, uh, I always think that, you know, a legitimate goal of cartoonist is to provoke. Uh, to provoke people into thinking, not into violence. You know, the kind of cartoons, uh, probably that Danish cartoonist, it provoke people into violence. You know, I am not okay with that kind of cartoon, that brand of cartoon. You know, our goal at the end of the day is to provoke people into thinking. So it has to be taken seriously. And, you know, I, Satish said, it's, uh, you know, I, I also don't take my cartoons that seriously, but I want people to take them seriously and to my trolls and, you know, they, they don't uh, affect me at all. Because my approach is that, you know, I just post it and forget it. These days, it's very difficult to engage people, you know, the kind of toxicity you have around. You know, it's, it's just not worth it engaging with them. You end up wasting your time, you know, the time which you might want to focus on better things in life, you know. So the better things for us to do than, you know, engaging with trolls. So uh, as you said, you know, it's a good employment opportunity is something is being done on that front. So I'm happy for them. And my message to you is that, you know, keep doing whatever you want to do. At least in fact, it works. work. You know, I don't even, you know, uh, beyond the point, there are times that, okay, when, when the trolling is massive, you know, you, you off and on, you check your phone, but it doesn't impact me at all. That's quite a That's Zen it, mode to yes. have. It doesn't impact you. I want to learn that. How do you get, go so Zen when so many people are, you know, viciously trolling? You know, when because, you know, access went to this too much of something, you get immune to it. Initially, it certainly does. You know, you can't deny that. But when, you know, access of something, then you said, it, 
तो होना ही है इस बाउंड तो है फिर नो नो गेटिंग अवे विद इट सो यू जस्ट शट योरसेल्फ टू दोस यू नो I suppose uh, responding to that kind of uh, while trolling yes, is to just yes. give them more things to troll about and do much more cartoons like you said that provoke. You said something yes. very interesting. You said the uh, the purpose of a cartoon is to provoke. Actually the purpose of every intelligent piece of literature of art is to provoke, provoke people into thinking, provoke people into questioning, provoke people into not settling for things as they are. Sajid, since we are discussing about social media trolls, you know the kind of uh, uh, toxicity that we face every day. Let's let's talk about the positives of social media for a cartoonist as yourself. What 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 would you would you would you think that social media has become a platform for you to reach a wider audience, a bigger space, much more? Uh, of course, there there is trolling, but is there also appreciation that you can take uh, solace in? Yes, of course. Uh, you know, uh, I work with a newspaper called Financial Chronicle. So it is a very small newspaper. Okay, so barely some five thousand or ten thousand people read the paper. Uh, but it's only through social media I, I was able to engage with uh, a larger audience. So, so social media really helped me that way. You know, as a cartoonist, as you know, how I plan my career. Social media has helped me a lot. 